Amber Bell here with Real Agriculture. I am at AgriTrade in Red Deer, Alberta, speaking with Tucker Bentley with John Deere. So it's great to see you, Tucker. Thank you. Okay, so we're going to be talking about your guys' forward-facing cameras for your combines coming out in 2025. Is that right? Yep, you bet. Okay, tell me a little bit about them. What makes us different? So as you can see, there is the cameras on the machines. It detects the crop 28 feet in front of the combine, and then so that helps with your down crop detection. So as that combine picks up that down crop, it will slow down to a set speed that you choose in the cab. So this helps with you. You just you don't do anything. The combine does it all for you. Very cool. And this is working with predictive yield maps. Is that right? Yeah. So they work together. So the combine knows the higher yielding areas and the lower yielding areas in the field, and they work together with the automation system. So the best way I've found to explain it is more like combines before have a cruise control, where this is your adaptive cruise control. The combine is speeding up and slowing down for you, and you don't do anything. You sit there and watch the watch the header and everything else. Right, and so going back to the basics, because really it's all about yield at the end of the day. Yep. And how is this helping farmers with their yield? So obviously you want to keep as much grain as you can in your machine. Money's losses are huge, like 1% loss over 3,000 acres is a substantial amount of money. And then with that, obviously, then your, produ your productivity is, you're going to keep peak productivity all day with the combine adjusting speed and horsepower limits and stuff. It'll stay at that horsepower limit and keep a consistent speed and throughput acres per hour all day. So, it, so if you're eating lunch, you're on your phone, you're not missing that. You're combining all day at that speed, not just, not slow down, speed up. Right, and then we spoke a little bit about automation. So can you go into that a bit more? Yeah, so different automation. So it has a 15 minute, in the screen, you'll see 15 minute time, time lapse kind of. So it'll show you your productivity and all that, your yield, the grain loss, your cracked grain, and as well as your foreign material. So material other than grain in the tank. So you'll see that and then It'll show you that, so it'll show you if you've actually made cha changes that have been better or worse. And then obviously with this, you can make changes too to the system, like aggressiveness of the speed change or aggressiveness of the system. And then with that as well, with the automation, you can turn off variables. So say it keeps turning up your fan speed and you don't want your fan speed up anymore, you can tell it, I want that off, and then the rest of the automation will still work. That's crazy. Well, thank you so much for joining us. That was Tucker Bentley at AgriTrade in Red Deer.